Hey guys, welcome back to another exciting episode. Now, I know I said I was going to do a uh, good wife, but honestly, I, well, I took a week off, a few weeks off actually, and uh, planned out what games I was going to play in it for a while, and I played a good wife ahead of time just to make sure just to have some suspic just to clear up some suspicions I was having and yeah it, it's pretty much the same game I'm just doing menial wife task instead but it has the same exact endings so here we are with a new game called the corridor which I've never heard of it's an indie game that I just found online and I'm playing it and all I can assume is that it's about a corridor and I think that's German it's in never seen this game before so yeah, here we go. Whew. Wonder what it's about. I woke up in the middle of the night in my apartment. I feel nervous for no reason. Wonder why I feel nervous. Whew. What's that thing? Can I read this? I can't read this. It's about a corridor. Uh, what am I looking for? This is weird. All right. F, so I use F to open. It's very strange. Yeah, I, I don't remember such a long corridor in the hotel. This is a hotel? Okay, so I'm a hotel member. Right. Huh. It's a nice picture, actually. Nice picture. These are good pictures. How long do I run around? How long do I run down this hall? Darkness. I don't like darkness. <laughs> ah! What was that? What was that? Ooga booga. Um, okay, that was creepy. Hope it doesn't do that again. Oh! Okay, disclaimer now. Okay, so that's an unsettling picture. So if you guys find any of these games, I'm so serious now though. If you guys find any of these games disturbing in any way, I'm so serious. Turn off this video. I don't want to offend people with these videos. And if these videos make you feel uncomfortable, Please turn them off. I would hate for you to feel uncomfortable in that, <laughs> in that way. So, please, please. Because I don't, I don't like hurting people. So, if these, like I said, if these videos make you feel uncomfortable, please turn them off. That is just a very uncomfortable picture, actually. Oh, yeah, it's very uncomfortable. Oh. Uh. How long this game goes on? Oh. Very disturbing, actually. Oh my gosh. What happened to the hotel? Where the fuck am I? Oh my gosh. 
like the last scary game I played. You guys saw me play this scary game. I didn't like it. <sighs> okay, so time for you guys to tell, learn about a little bit about me. Um, well, the first scary thing I actually saw. I used to be very comfortable with scary stuff when I was a kid. I used to really like scary stuff, actually. That's very unsettling. I used to like scary stuff a whole bunch. But then there was this new movie that came out. It was called The Grudge. And that just freaked me the life out as a kid. Like, I just... Uh, I had nightmares about that for weeks. And then that's probably where it started. And now I'm somewhat okay with scary stuff. I'm, but most of the movies that they come out with now aren't really as scary as some of the original. But then there's always that one that is scary. Like the one that recently spooked me was like, Are You Afraid of the Dark? Don't Be Afraid of the Dark, I think it was called. And yeah, that, that was a scary movie. Like I still check the vents in my house. To make sure every time I hear a noise creaking in my house, which is kind of creepy, freaks me out sometimes. Uh, blood. I hear somebody breathing behind me. Unsettling. Oh my gosh. Like I literally just felt goosebumps on my skin. No, 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 normality. Thank you, normality. Thank you, normality. Oh, that was just a nightmare. I hope. Yeah! Well, that was a fun short game. All right. Well, I guess that's the end. Oh, the scare at the end. Oh, I didn't see that coming. Okay, that was freaky. Whew. It's not as scary as other games, but it is very unsettling. And the atmosphere, it just keeps you on edge. Like, every time they hear that children lying, like, <laughs> it just makes you feel all awkward on the inside. So I just, like... I'm not gonna lie, I had to stay on my toes a little bit. I had that Five Nights at Freddy's mojo going on where I had to, I was looking out for everything, like every crack, every bump. Especially when that thing, when I saw that thing right behind me, I was just like, where the heck did that thing come from? Oh my gosh. But it's still a fun game. Like, if you, if you want a quick scare on Halloween, like, you probably play it. Like, it's a really good game. Um, other than that... Uh, yeah, I'm recording this game. This ga I'm sorry, guys, if I seem out of it. I'm just recording this game at, like, what is it? I gotta check my phone. 10.05 at night. Uh, yeah. Whew. It's, uh, it, after a long day. Uh, it's been a long day. Um, I think my, bro my brother had a party today, and, yeah, it's just been difficult. So... Yeah, that's it for this episode. I will see you guys in the next one. And according to my 
do to do list, it will most likely be a game called Find the Light. So, yeah, that's gonna be fun. Metal Gear out.